My name is Tim Lipscomb. I'm a s senior organizer for the Northern California Carpenters. All right. And we just like to make a couple of points here. The Carpenters Union opposes the sale of Adams Middle School right. to Ron Beller and Caliber Schools, basically under three points. Number one, is that there's no commitment to prevailing wages. Prevailing wages are a foundation for working people in any community. Number two, no commitment to apprenticeship and career pathways for our young people, men, women, minorities, returning veterans. Apprenticeship has always been an avenue for people in the local community yeah. to gain a gainful employment, to build a career, because not every student in school is going to be able to afford to go to college. So the building trades and the carpenters have, have always tried to produce career pathways for our young folks. Three, with no commitment to apprenticeship and training, there's no commitment to quality construction, quality seismically safe construction. Having experienced people build these schools is essential. West Contra Costa Unified School District has a great track record of doing good quality construction. They also have a track record of, of producing good quality pathways for our young folks. If we stand by and let Calibre Schools build these schools privately and bring in folks like Big D Construction from Utah that came in and built a Spire School, and had no concern about putting local folks together, putting local folks to work, putting local folks into career, good quality career pathways of apprenticeship, and then ongoing training for those journeyman carpenters to work on those sites. That's what we do in the building trades. We build up our community by putting young folks to work and can ongoing con training for folks that work in the trade. We met with Ron Beller, and he said he couldn't make that commitment because there wasn't enough money. He only had 15 million. And could we donate money to his school? I said, what we can do is we can donate quality folks to build that school. I said, how can you skimp on, on quality construction? I said, what's next? You'll skimp on teachers? He says, oh, already we can't afford to, to hire the best teachers. It's like, come on, man. Get your program together. Have a heart. Have some faith in the community that we will come in. And even if you want to build these schools, if you look at this school and you think you're going to get a bid of, say, whatever the lowest possible it's going to be, I've done lots of, of uh, remodel construction, and you don't know what you're going to get once you open up them walls, what you're going to find in there. So it's essential, I try to tell them, it's essential that you have a quality, you know, uh, quality general contractor that knows how to do this type of construction. So it's going to take a lot to get Ron to see the light, and I think it's a great thing that the community is standing together. I think it's a great thing that you folks are out here and that we bring light to the situation, because I'm telling you, Prop 39 is hurting our state, and it's going to hurt the public, the public, uh, the public education system. So it's great to see everybody out here, and the Carpenters uh, Local 152 opposes the sale of Adams Middle School to Caliber School. Thanks for coming out.